All right, so here we have our old intake manifold. Here we have ZZP ported intake manifold. Comes with new gaskets. Comes with a new ground wire. It even comes with new bolts, which is great because I had dropped one. Actually, when taking this out, let me just show you where it was, just in case this happens to anybody else taking out their manifold. So, the bolt that was over here, see, can I focus? So you can see, one of them I dropped from here and it went all the way to the ground, there's no problem. But then there's one that's over in this area, and it fell down. I was expecting it to go under the starter here, but nope. It kept going down even further. It went under, um, let's see, can I get this camera down here more? Underneath this axle, and it kept going even lower. There's like a lip down there. Oh, I guess you can't really see it. Underneath that axle, there's a lip where this uh, motor mount is. It was down there. I could not find it until I jacked the car up and went underneath. Um, let's see. So, comparing the differences here, the OEM one has all these lips or whatever you want to call them. I guess I'll just call them lips. And they literally block almost half the airflow. And I didn't know that it was almost half until I got out my caliper tool. So, let's see if I could show you. Oh, and also, ZZP ported this too. Which, when I measured that with my caliper, it was still the same, but it's just a lot smoother in there compared to the OEM one. I don't know how well you can see this, but um, there's like kind of a lip right here. So they smooth that out. I guess it's mostly just that lip that they smooth out. Yeah. And so let me show you, you guys here with the caliper tool the huge difference so if I measure across the center hold on I'll show you in a second okay there we go across the center 0 0.771 right around there and then with the OEM one uh, let me position this. There we go. 0 0.4. I've seen lower than that though in some spots. Hold on. 3.9. Earlier I was seeing like 0 0.37 even. 3.8. But yeah, so huge, huge difference across there. Oh, I can also measure not in the center, but like on one of the sides. Whoa, sorry. Hard doing this. Phone in one hand, tool in the other. So, I go over to the side a little bit here. See, 0 0.84. That's on the ported one. And now from the factory OEM, only 0 0.51. So, huge difference. You're getting almost double the airflow with a ported manifold and see did I leave anything out uh, ZDP also gives you a new vacuum line here and then I'm not sure what you call this piece here where the vacuum lines connect but yeah it's really nice what all they include with this I'm really pleased with it um wasn't able to take a video of me taking it out. That would have been a long video because this is my first time doing it. But maybe I could do a video of me putting it back in. But yeah, quite a big difference. Oh, and of course it comes with a, a new PCB valve. I almost forgot to mention that. If my camera would focus, then you can see it. It's a little orange nipple down in there. Well, I guess it's not going to focus, so you have to take my word for it. But yeah, the PCB valve has um, failed in mine. So, 
Anyways.